All right, team. Um, Saturday night, middle of the night. <laughs> we got off work, work, and we rock star partied for, I don't know. We went about 24 hours, took a two-hour nap. I've been up for a while, but I haven't been doing much. And now it's time to get back to work. Um, once a week pickups. Got the mix of aluminum and steel and some aluminum wheels. The garage door is still broken. I haven't done a thing about it. I noticed this panel's a little bent too. It looks like it came loose. So, I don't know. I think I can bend it back. I don't know why. I don't know if that has something to do with when the spring broke. It yanked it up. Mm, yeah, I don't know. No, I haven't done anything. I haven't tried to source a part. I haven't done anything. I have noticed, though, when your garage door is broken, your garage stays a lot cleaner. Because you can't just bring everything inside, throw it on the floor, and, you know, do it later. you got to kind of take care of it right away. You only bring the stuff in the garage you really want in the garage. <laughs> Because the stuff you don't want in the garage, you're just going to have to carry back out later, uh, you know, in an awkward way, not just go right out the door with it. So I've been doing a lot more sorting in the driveway type of stuff. Oh. Anyway, the plan is... Oh, we went really, really long on maintenance. That's why we're doing a middle of the night. Because normally we do four or five hours of maintenance. Usually it's close to five. Um, we did around eight hours. So we got back really late. Well, really late compared to how, how late we get back. Um, and I'm a little spacey because I've always slept two hours. Well, anyway, plan is we will scrap down this stuff, and then I need to go pick up gasoline. And since I normally work nights and I can't sleep at night, I will probably go do that and pay at the pump when no one's there. <laughs> and it's nice and cool out because it's actually getting up close to 80. It's getting into the 70s most days now. Lows in the 50s, maybe high 40s. So it's cooler in the evening, but not so cool. You don't want to be outside. All right, let's let's scrap down. And then, I don't know, we'll go from there. All right, team, Sunday morning. We got to clean out the trailer. Just got done at a job, got home. Now we gotta clean this up. All right, team, still Sunday morning. We got the trailer unloaded. Got everything cut up and put in the trash. Put away the tools, parked the Jeep. Um, I gotta fix my spreader. It's missing its... Uh, agitator wire or stirring wire or whatever ended up having a bunny hop this thing all over the yard to get it to dump the stuff <sighs> um i may just like make something out of a coat hanger or something because I was hoping it was just laying in the trailer, you know, fell out on the drive over. And then I never noticed dumping, dumped the fertilizer in. And I couldn't figure out why it was spreading so slowly. 
then when it got down low enough, I realized it wasn't turning it. Whew, it's warm out already. Of course, I'm overdressed. I'm dressed for dark dawn. Got pajama pants still. I'm actually wearing a flannel. Um, I think that's it. Went by that rental, did some touch-up this morning. And then we came back to unload and dispose of everything. I still got to put some tools away. Got to put away. That was trash. Those are tools. And those are tools. The blue one's the church tote. We did our scrap down. It's all taken care of as well. There was not enough to make a trip. I just threw it in here for the church. There wasn't enough to warrant a drive over there to get rid of it. Oh, I missed this bottle. All right. I think that's it, team. How about we just call that a video? Because I, at this point, don't have a plan. So let's do that. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. We'll see you next week, team.